Hi, and welcome back to YA Conversations. I'm George. I'm Madeline. I'm Zach. And today's guest is Kelly Mahalchak. Hello. <laughs> so we're just going to dive right in, and today's topic of conversation is going to be connection. So we brought in Kelly because it brought in Kelly because she is a connection expert. Kelly, why don't you give us a little bit of history on why you love connecting with people so much? Mm-hmm. Is that good? Yeah, that is really good. <laughs> That's a great question, Madeline. <laughs> Uh, you know, the funny thing is, is when I started coming to Impact Church, um, part of the mentoring with Pastor Cheryl was looking at some personality types, and one of the Now Discover Your Strengths was Harmony, which is about building bridges with people, and I was really upset about that at first, uh, <laughs> thinking, oh, I'll just build a bridge with anyone, but when I look, really thought about it and look back on my life, I could see that wherever I have been, I've created little communities. Whether that was working um, and making a lunch club, making a book club, um, I'm that person on Facebook who's always suggesting friends. Yeah. I am that girl. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So wherever I go, there's going to be a little community. I can't even help myself. This <laughs> must be killing you then. Have all this isolation? <laughs> the, yes. What are you doing? How are you finding ways to uh, connect mm-hmm. with COVID? Well, I not I, connect with COVID. That's right. Well, I do think that connecting is very important, mm-hmm. um, and I do think that we all need to obey our physical distancing and, you know, definitely um, hand hygiene and all of that. Very, very important. Uh, but I do think that there are ways that we can connect. I will tell you about what I did on Sunday, as a matter of fact. In the afternoon, I went to a birthday party. It was in a parking lot, and we separately went through the parking lot in our own vehicles and got an ice cream uh, to celebrate uh, the birthday boy. So he went into the parking lot, opened up his gifts, of which we honked our horns. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, we yelled out, happy birthday! Uh, and but you know what we saw a smile Mm -hmm. on face and so that was really good Mm -hmm. making the best out of a bad situation Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so different ways to celebrate birthdays then time to get creative it is time to get creative I'm sure that you guys would have been doing some things as well what have you guys been doing to connect with your friends um I think like a couple of weeks ago, we had like a little dinner party on Zoom. So we all grabbed our own dinner. Mm-hmm. We grabbed something to drink and then we all just chatted on Zoom and it was actually fun. Yeah. Yeah. What a great idea. That mm-hmm. does sound like fun. I text people. Yeah, that's yeah. good. Pretty easy, pretty basic. It's just yeah. about my level. I enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? That's good. You know what? I actually received something in the mail from a friend, yeah, sent me a card in the mail with a little note. Uh, I don't know how much time it would have taken, but it was really just a nice surprise at mm-hmm. this time. So maybe it's time to pull out the pen and paper mm-hmm. and send That's a little, little note. Mail. Yeah. I was doing a regular activity the other day. Uh, it was like a Saturday night and I was baking and I thought, oh, why not invite just some friends Mm-hmm. If anyone's bored because they can't go out on a Saturday night, invite them to my baking time. So that's what I did. I just sent them a link. Mm-hmm. I said, well, I'm on a Zoom call baking. If you want to join, just come join. So I did. I had a couple people join a little bit later. So that was fun. That sounds fun. What were you baking? I was baking brownies for Easter. Oh, so very they nice. They turned out good. That goes good with our health and wellness episode from last week. Right? Yeah. <laughs> just say it. Just say it. Yes, it you does. can eat whatever you want. <laughs> as no, long as good. you feel comfortable. I'm, I am a big advocate for balance. So I will have a salad and then I had my brownie along with it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so people out there, people are feeling disconnected. How how do you uh, how do young adults at this stage, how do you be intentional about connecting? I mean, what do you do? Well that's a very valid question. I do think that there are a few things you could do. Mm-hmm. 
Uh, I know that there are some impact groups running. It would require the use of Zoom. Mm -hmm. And I was in one, and it's so nice to see people's faces, not just hear their voice, but to mm -hmm. see their face. Mm -hmm. yeah. It feels so good. And it's yeah. so easy to get into. Yeah, a few clicks, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, so not too hard. Mm -hmm. um, as much as possible, like I, Impact Church is pumping out content, stay connected to the voice that you're already familiar with yeah. mm -hmm. and enjoy everything they're putting out. Get in on the chats and mm -hmm. join the virtual lobby mm -hmm. and do all of that fun mm -hmm. stuff. And I think I heard something about uh, this Friday or the Friday coming up at some point, there's something happening. Mm -hmm. There's a young adult Zoom call. <laughs> well, uh, let us know. If you want to get in on that, 7 o'clock on Friday, we're going to do a, a Zoom call just for young adults. So we'll publish the, the link for that on the, the social media pages. And uh, it'd be great to see everybody. And I, uh, Everybody's routine is really disrupted right now, but yeah. I'm finding that one of the things that kind of brings a little bit of normalcy to life is when you see the same people. Yes. Yeah. And uh, as a serious introvert, I guess this is news to me, but I'm I'm appreciating the fact that that I I appreciate finding ways to connect with the regular people in my life. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's not just you know that you do the same things every day, but there's people built into your life on purpose that actually bring you joy and are, are really good for you to be around. So it's a, it's good to find ways to connect with. The same people, right? Oh yeah, mm -hmm. and uh, yes. Jo tune in mm -hmm. on Friday. Zach is going to be displaying one of his talents. You know, I've been trying to <laughs> find <laughs> out. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Yet. <laughs> You're going to find out with me. Yeah. Actually, I've been trying to find out how can we do an online karaoke. So comment below if you want that, because I'm sure George can figure out oh, how George to make can that totally happen. Yeah, mm -hmm. it'd be George so much fun. We should get that going. Mm -hmm. right. Everyone could pull up the lyrics on their. Uh, they can pull up the lyrics on their laptop and then sing along. Yeah. Sure. Mm, good thinking. Or you, I actually just had an idea. If you're a reader or you want to start becoming a reader, you can find a friend. You guys pick a book together because it's super easy to download books for cheap now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or even um, <clears throat> if you are with the public library, you can actually create an online account and then just like download the ebook, but there's a lot of ways. And then you guys can go through the book together and some of the books would even have discussion questions surrounding some of the chapters and some of the topics that are covered. But I mean, it can be fiction, nonfiction. Um, so that would be another fun way to connect. Fun. Mm -hmm. sure. sure, we used to do uh, young adult meals. We could even do that if anybody's up for it. We could do uh, like, a cooking show. Yeah, Friday night cooking show where we're all cooking together. We make pizza again. I can burn some hamburgers again. For <laughs> <laughs> yeah, connecting. Yeah. So speaking of hamburgers, I actually uh, had a barbecue and um, I invited my mom from afar and I dropped a burger off for her and walked away and she came and picked up her burger, uh, you know, wiped, wiped, I put it in wrapping so she could yeah, wipe the yeah. wrapping down and get mm -hmm. the burger mm -hmm. and, and then we were kind of yelling at each other from <laughs> afar, but it was really good to see her. So, mm -hmm. you know, thing, little things like that that you yeah. can do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. why you're the connecting expert. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Friday, 7 o'clock on mm -hmm. Zoom. Look at our social media, Facebook, yeah. Instagram. Uh, we'll, if we got your email, we'll send you an email too, let you know. But uh, Friday, 7 o'clock, young adults on Zoom. Hope to be able to see you there. Yeah. Put your connecting ideas below. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for being here with us, Kelly. Yes. We'll see you all next week, and have a great time. Bye. Bye. <laughs>